Dockploy versus Easy Panel. Having used both for deploying and managing apps, I've noticed some clear differences that really shape how you'd pick one depending on your needs. Both are great lightweight deployment panels focused on simplicity and speed, but they have slightly different vibes and features that stood out to me during hands-on use. Dockploy is kind of like that straightforward, no-nonsense deploy tool. It's open source, and the setup was pretty smooth for me. Just clone the repo, configure a few environment variables, and you're basically ready to start pushing apps. It's built mainly around managing Docker containers, so if you're already comfortable with Docker, this feels very natural. I liked how Dockploy makes deployment a breeze with Git integration. You just push your code, and it builds and runs the container automatically. It supports custom domains, SSL, and even has a way to run scheduled tasks through cron-like jobs, which was pretty handy. But it's somewhat minimalistic. If you want fancy UI stuff or detailed logs, you might have to dig around or add your own tools. The UI is clean but simple, not overloaded with options, which is perfect if you want to get stuff done fast without distractions. For me, Dockploy felt like a no-frills, reliable buddy for deploying containerized apps quickly. Now, EasyPanel is a bit more polished in terms of user experience and has a more modern dashboard. When I tried it, I immediately noticed how easy it was to manage not just the deployments, but also SSL certificates, databases, and environment variables all from one place without jumping through hoops. EasyPanel supports Docker under the hood as well, but it layers on more automation and UI polish. The one click lets you add new sites or services, and it also supports background workers or cron jobs easily, which is a plus. The real charm is in its management of databases. Adding and connecting MySQL or Postgres was smooth, and it felt more like a mini hosting control panel tailored for Docker apps. Plus, EasyPanel does automatic SSL certificate renewal, which was a nice hands-off bonus for me. One thing I noticed, though, is that EasyPanel can feel a bit heavier compared to Dockplay, so it might need a tad more resources, but nothing crazy. Performance-wise, both panels run lean and don't add noticeable overhead to the server. The speed at which Dockplay spins up or updates containers is pretty fast, while EasyPanel's additional features come with a bit more UI overhead, but still very responsive. If you're someone who loves a simple CLI-focused deploy flow, Dockploy is a great choice. If you prefer a friendlier, richer web UI with extra tools like database management baked in, EasyPanel takes the lead. In terms of scalability, I'd say Dockploy is great for smaller projects or developers who want to keep their deployment stack lean and mostly under control with Docker commands. EasyPanel, meanwhile, feels more suited for users who want to manage multiple projects or sites from a single panel and appreciate having database and SSL automation in one place without extra setups. Overall, I often found myself using Dockploy when I needed to deploy something fast and lightweight without fuss. For more feature-rich management, especially if I'm handling databases and want smoother SSL handling, EasyPanel was my go-to. Both are solid tools in the Docker deployment space. It really boils down to whether you want minimal and quick with Dockploy or a fuller, more managed experience with EasyPanel.